yeah it helps a lot to be frank it helps a lot without those mock interviews we can't able to sit even in the one interview uh, we can't even give that uh, one mock interview yeah my experience was it's awesome it's i think there is no question about it because they're all uh, software engineers who are currently working itself and the concepts on the apart from the classes also they sometimes they go apart from it and they try to help us in whatever in thoughts we have <laughs>
coming to the placements i think there is no shortage of companies for at your jobs we are going to get something or the other each and every day we are going to get to apply for it cool. <clears throat> and how many companies did you sit for yeah i sat for two companies one company i went till last uh, technical round mm-hmm. uh, but due to nervousness uh, i messed up in last technical round <laughs> right. but in second company uh, i did became conscious but not that nervous so i could able to clear it okay great but given talking given you're talking about nervousness i want to ask you something there are so many students who are nervous all the time but they are also very hesitant in giving technical and hr mock interviews which we provide right how much do you think these interviews help students in their final placement yeah it helps a lot to be frank it helps a lot without those mock interviews we can't able to sit even in the one interview or we can't even give that uh, one mock interview in my condition where it's been since i think 4 years i gave any interview or experienced any sort of interview it's the last when in my campus placements i faced any interview so even in my in my case i was hesitant in giving mock interviews at first case uh my best friend is a crush called me and said why didn't you book your mock interview for the first first mock interview so i, I still remember that day i was so tense to book the mock interview itself because i was not confident enough for that i'm not ready to take what's going to come but that fear we must overtake it and we must give the mock interviews as many as possible this is the thing which is going to help us right understood so how were your mentors at akil job who taught you your instructors how was your experience with them yeah my experience was it's awesome it's i think there is no question about it it was they're all uh, software engineers who are currently working itself and the concepts on the apart from the classes also they sometimes they go apart from it and they try to help us in whatever in thoughts we have uh, they take out some time from the class or they remain uh, last 10 minutes or they give us last 5 minutes and they explain what to what went wrong for us right got it so how did raja software happen yeah at the first place when i applied at the uh, same it was very nervous because for me it's an time limit uh, as the time passes the gap between my graduation increases day by day there's the tension in my mind it's con- continuously haunting me so after the other software labs i went regretfully about the company first of all what the what is it's going to be the process of it and and we also have uh, interactions with the candidates who already cracked the Ra- raja software labs from yeah. acquire itself mm-hmm. so we will be having guidance prior guidance on what it's what it would be like we can say uh, what it could be like the interview process would be in my case uh, first it was an uh, coding round uh, in the sense we will have coding mcqs and uh, quantitative and aptitude mcqs where it is mainly focused on coding itself mcqs after clearing that the same day it would be a programming round where they will be giving some questions and we need to write the program and we need to send it after these two they will, they will be having uh, three uh, three technical interviews okay so when you look back at the time you've spent four years preparing for upsc right what do you think have been your biggest learnings be confident of yourself trust yourself this is the biggest learning in whatever situation you are trust yourself there uh, anything the situation that the, the trust on yourself gives you the con- confidence to do anything so as you see you know becoming an ce now at at trust software what advice do you want to give to the upcoming students in this field advice in the sense i think uh, more practice that's it and follow the classes or anything what's the source they are following if you want to join the aqo you just follow the mentors and follow the guidelines what you are going to get it's just helps a lot that's it blindly believe it. you give your best give 100% you are going to have give your hard work practice as many models as you can and it's going to work that's it don't be decided for one two or two companies going to be rejected it's going to happen for us that's it i think rejection is a part of the process yeah where we can learn more as well yes i understand i think if 
if you might have not been rejected in the first one you might not have worked that hard for the second one yeah exactly exactly i'm very glad that i had been rejected for the first time <laughs> I came to know about lot of things and it improved my confidence as well because after the first rejection I went rigorously into the subject again it gave me one type of challenge for me again why did it happen why I did messed up so it challenged me I gave more mock interviews of it after it I went through it I practiced more questions you got it and if you know before we end this interview I have just one last question for you Sampath, if you could define at your job and your experience with us in one word or in one line, how would you define it? Yeah, I would define it as an awesome. Uh, I think it would be a small for me myself, but I couldn't find the word uh, larger than it. It's very helpful and it's very joyful too. To learn. It's a process of learning combined with uh, interest. Creating interest is also a part of uh, at your job, I think. Got it. I'm just, first of all I'm so glad that you had such a good experience with us Sampath and we are very yeah, happy to you. see you please in a good company at a good with a good role you know and I wish you the best for everything and thank you so much for giving us the time today thank you thank you so much. thank you everyone for watching our interview with Sampath please like share subscribe and let us know in the comment section which part of Sampath's journey inspired you the most and yes have a good day and keep learning thank you